Do you want any coins? Of course you don't, because EA fucked us in the ass because we can't buy any fucking coins now. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today is going to be a little bit of a round video. Um, pretty sure everyone knows what's coming. Uh, basically, everyone knows that EA has fucked them in the ass because that is basically what's happened. Um, as you see, people at EA have put price ranges on the fucking players. I know you hate YouTubers so much, but I didn't know you hated it that much that you actually fucked us with the fucking transfer market. What is your problem? Like, YouTubers are literally dead. Like, I don't know what we're gonna do because you can't buy fucking coins anymore. So, we can't get players. So, what's the point? We, can't, we can buy coins, but we'll have to list up a player that's worth that many coins so basically there's no point of buying coins because you might as well just sell, sell that player so there's no point of buying coins anymore and now EA are the biggest money whores I've like I've never seen a company that been this much obsessed with fucking money like how much money do they want us to spend on fucking FIFA points FIFA points are literally ridiculous like buy 1 million coins for a tenner on a website and that will get you twice as many packs that you would spend 80 quid on 12,000 FIFA points I don't see why like the only solution is they either reduce FIFA points prices or may increase the chances of getting a good player in a pack I mean if people got good players in the pack regularly that would make the game good but basically the transfer market is basically what makes FIFA so I have no idea what's gonna happen with YouTubers like they they most YouTubers promote coin selling that's what they most of their living is off of but I don't I'm not moaning that much about co um, coin promoting because I don't get that much out of it anyway so that doesn't really matter for me so um, there's gonna be no wages pretty much well there could be wages but i'm not sure how it's going to work um no one's going to be able to get any coins anymore like i don't see the only way of getting coins now is basically buying fifa points and opening the packs or i don't know what they've done to the play the games online games i don't know if they've increased the money that you get with it but I don't know what's going to happen, um, but yeah, basically FIFA is pretty much dead and I don't know why they did it in the middle of the game when Team of the Season is about to come out. Team of the Season is going to die, like, what are you going to do with it? Like, you open the packs, your people have no choice but to buy FIFA points, but to open packs or sell the players in your club to get coins, to open packs, to get the Team of the Seasons. So, like, stupid players like... Frick what is his name? Roberto Carlos. He's been going on the market for like 10 million coins, 9 million coins recently, but now they've capped his price to minimum, minimum 1.5 and maximum 3 million. People are going to lose so much money if they bought it before. So I, I feel sorry for them. Like some people, they have got a loss and some people have got an increase. Like some people have bought players before that are less than what their play prices are going for now. Um, so at the start of this game, Messi was going about two, three million coins. Now he's going for like 10 million. But as you see on the screen, his price has been minimum five million, max price seven million, 7.5 million. That's just for his normal card. But as you see, you've got Hazard here, he's been moved from He's, he's like 3.10 million, uh, 3.10 thousand coins, um, 100 thousand coins minimum and 470 thousand. Um, so all the, as you see on the screen now, um, all the player prices will be across all consoles, Xbox, PlayStation, PC. I don't think iOS are going to do anything to be honest because their prices are all messed up already. Um, there's going to be no a uh, bin, um, minimum, like bin for the players is all going to be buy it now, um, because bin was pretty much that was really annoying actually. If you list it for 150, you lose so much money. It's actually retarded. But um, yeah, I don't know if EA are going to do anything else with this fucking game because I don't see how much they, how much more they can ruin this game. Um, so I have no idea that how that's going to happen. So. 
pretty much the, the transfer market is the main part of this game. So I don't know what people can do about coin selling. Um, YouTubers, I know that EA hate YouTubers so much, but I don't see how they have to blame YouTubers on this whole thing. It's like we hate them, they hate us. It's basically that's how it basically works. Um, so yeah, I don't see how this is going to work to be honest. But if they add anything else that makes it better, then I would consider making this a good idea. But it's up, it's your opinion. This is my opinion. If it's a good or bad, leave in the comments if you think it's good or if it's a bad thing. Um, it, you, you, you all have your own opinions of what you do with the game or like trading as well. That's gonna, people aren't gonna like that. If you're a trader on the game, it's not gonna work very well for you. Um, so yeah, I don't particularly trade that much, so I don't really care about that. Um, I just see how it's going to. It's basically going to break the game, actually. Um, I don't see how Team of Season is going to go because you can't put it up for. You can't quick sell, like, you can't quick list items when you go on Team of Season with all those lightning packs. I don't see how that's going to work. Team of Season is just. I would understand if they started doing this at the start of FIFA 16, but in the middle of the game, it's pretty annoying. Uh, but yeah, that's my run uh, <laughs> all over. If you got any more um, comments you want to put down about this matter, then um, leave a comment down below. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, guys.